Good afternoon everyone. Uh, it's been a while since I upload videos, but I will be uploading more interesting videos and comparisons and well, I hope you like them. Lego Technic Guy says hi, so let's begin this review. For this review I'm gonna review a few pencils, now that the whole colorful trends are uh, uh, coming back and longing for late 80s early 90s colorful pencils I'm gonna show you some of my collection and I hope you enjoy this this for example the first is the triangles from Empire Barrel as you can see these pencils were made in 1992 these are triangle shaped they have metallic color they have black ferrule and black eraser these are very very rare an open package I found these on a on an old stationery shop these are made in USA but they were imported over here to Mexico in the early 90s and I was found, I was lucky to find this old stock uh, when these guys uh, found those and they started selling them again so I got a, a couple of packages of these I have over here a pair of open ones As you can see, it says number two grade, USA Triangles and Empire Barrel. You can see it's a very light wooden, light wood. Okay, too much lighting over here. So, well, you get the point. This is a purple one. And over here I have a blue one. I already used a red and a green one. These are very comfortable, they have a nice uh, graphite tone. And, well, there's uh, this huge trend of bringing back colorful pencils, as you will see. Then there were also these hexagonal metallic ones. These are also from Empire Barrel. These are the metallics. Also a rare, an open package from the early 90s, imported, and which they also found all stock in their storage room. These are very interesting, they're basically metallic uh, silver uh, ferrule as well as metallic colors which is uh, like a pink or fuchsia, gold, green and purple and the erasers are colored yellow, purple, pink and green. So these are an interesting when the whole metallic trend was going on in the 90s, I don't know if some people remember. These also are an open. And then we also have the what I call the whole the holy grail, sorry, the holy grail of pencils. Oops. Okay, my bad. Sorry about that. Too heavy. Okay, sorry. I have a Lego tripod which is a little too heavy, so that's why. Uh, a little too much weight with the camera. Okay, as I was saying, the holy grail of colorful pencils and the most sought after of them all. The Yikes pencils. Yikes pencils were the first ones and they even had a TV commercial which you can look for on YouTube which had neon colors. They were very bright, they were like the IT pencils from the early 90s. Again, this old package is also from like 1992, made in USA when USA still used to make pencils. These are round barrel and they have neon wacky colors. As you can see, even the wood is colored. This is wood, this is not resin. This is fully wood and uh, even the varnish is colored. As you can see, they have Empire Barrel Jikes. They have, oh, as you can see over here, they have number two as well in USA. The Ferrules color, they have blue, pink, black, darker uh, purple again black and then as well the erasers so these are very sought after these go for crazy prices on youtube and well i was lucky to snatch this package which are unopened since 1992 as you can see this package came with six pencils and the other variant for these pencils there were the triangle ones as you can see triangles over here so this one also has the, quir the quirky designs and style of the figures 
as you can see the comics comic book type <coughs> these are triangles same as the other ones they also have the wood so color this is wood this is not resin you have purple lime green yellow turquoise pink and orange and as you can see even the erasers are also colorful green purple lilac purple green greenish turquoise orange and yellow and the ferrules are also metal and they're also color which make them very neat so these pencils were pretty much the the it pencils in the 90s very rare to find in this condition i was lucky to find these old stocks uh which are an old a very old uh stationery shop uh had some left alone and they brought them back like a couple of years ago so i bought several and well these are really really nice pencils virtually collectible type and this whole trend they were this so popular which they eventually uh they're bringing them back colors from other brands let me show you a few examples one example is the Dixon Ticonderoga they launched this pencil called the stripes it's basically the same green and yellow ferrule black eraser but it has a black varnish with stripes neon colors this is a pinkish purplish one but they're also yellow green uh, blue light blue so this is like the closer you can get to a color pencil but kind of bringing a, a neon uh, tones to it this has the regular uh, wooden inside it's not colored and then we also have the other popular ones which is the ones that you'll see more likely on shops French big ones they also try to bring back that popularity from the old uh, Yikes pencils these are hexagonal these are a special composite of resin this is not specially wood so they make a weird uh, burning smell when they uh, when they start sharpen as you can see there are several colors these are the colors they have they have dark blue with orange inside they all have the purple ferrule plastic ferrule and the white eraser as whole well, bix we have also the orange with yellow inner color we have the green one with the purple I mean the sorry the pink inside we have the light blue one with orange yellow with green tone we have the burgundy red with a green inner we have the fuchsia pink with yellow inside and the purple with yellow inside so these bigs are the more closer to bringing back the whole jacks experience then we also have other big ones but not likely that much color but there is also the big in a whole uh, wood tone just like a slight water varnish so if you like them to look more natural look and no colors then they also have like the whole gray one which also the inside is also gray so it gives it a more sleeker cleaner look this one has a silver ferrule looking and a white eraser as all the other ones this is one of the few ones with a metal ferrule the other ones are with a purple plastic ferrule and this one is with a green plastic ferrule to give it a more natural look then we also have the stripes ones these are also sold in many markets this the inside is the same tone as the stripes we see blue and green stripes and the inside is green and there are also other color variants but I just had this one uh, on hand and finally we have the old black one also from Bic this is the old black this has a pinkish wood like color but this black varnish purple plastic ferrule and same white eraser Bic used to make these pencils in all wood and color green but then they changed to this uh, I don't know if we to call it revolutionary uh, material which is like a sort of resin which is more eco-friendly and uh, and so they're bringing this trend of bringing back the whole color this worked well but I personally feel like this uh, they're to be